but it's nice to come back to, to play like this. I mean, I used to play in a place like this myself when I was younger, so um, yeah, it's good to, to come, and, come and see the kids play and, and just try and give them a little bit of advice along the way. Half term, soccer school, February half term, we've got 120 children, which is fantastic. Boys and girls, we had a two day girls uh, soccer school Tuesday, Wednesday, and we've also got a five day soccer school running at Embrook School. So in all, we're probably seeing just over 250 children this week from the ages of five up to 40. We always talk about next generation of supporters. Here are your next generation of supporters. We've got a lot more children wearing like Reading kits as well. And I think it just, it gives it, the, they see the stadium when they come. Obviously this is part of the academy and the girls set up as well. So it just makes them feel like really part of the club. And um, yeah, it's a real pull for us. I think they're all, they're all really good, whether it's uh, coming, to the, coming to these, going to the one outside where they're a bit older. Um, to the to the, the deaf team as well. I think it's nice to come out and and uh, just show that you you appreciate every, everyone and everyone's trying to become better players at the end of the day. So um, yeah, it's nice to come. It's nice to help out. It's nice to, to answer questions that they have and um, yeah, just do, just do my part really. I mean, we deliver 30 after school clubs a week off site again and all our centres. So we find that more kids are wearing the Reading kits now and. Um, Probably more kids wearing Reading kits than there were 10 years ago. But you can see the courses today, more and more kids are wearing the Reading kit, which is great for us. Yes, it's a lot better. Obviously, kids, when you come out and do the, the videos on Zoom call, it's not the same because you, you're sort of speaking to a camera. But when uh, the players actually come here and show their face and, and answer questions that the, that the lads have, it's, uh, it's really important to if they take one thing away from, from today, from what I've said, and, and it, it will make them a better player, and then that's my uh, that's why I come here to help out, and um, hopefully I did that today. We've done the Zoom calls, we've done the, the Zoom visits as well, and, and nothing's the same as, as actually the kids coming out in the fresh air playing. It's not just their physical well-being, it's their mental well-being as well, which we're suffering. So getting out, socialising with their friends, playing with their friends is the most important thing. And like I said, the icing on the cake would be getting professional footballers out to speak to them to make their day, so it's fantastic.